Each year, the UK Jilsa Salana attracts numerous senior dignitaries from many different countries across the globe. They travel thousands of miles to be in the presence of the spiritual head of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community and take blessings from him directly. In honour of these guests, a variety of receptions are held with the Honourable Khalifa of Islam, His Holiness Hazrat Mirza Masroor Ahmad, may Allah strengthen his hands, the worldwide head of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community. On Sunday 7th September 2014, a reception was organised by the Pan-African Ahmadiyya Muslim Association for its senior dignitaries, presidents and missionaries. This event, under the guidance of His Holiness, was dedicated in memory of late Mulana Abdul Wahab Adam, who served as national president of the Ahmadiyya Muslim community Ghana until his sad demise in June of this year. Respected Mulana Wahab had served as national president since 1975 when he was appointed to office. He had studied from Jamia Ahmadiyya in Pakistan and was a renowned scholar and man of peace wherever he travelled. On his sad demise, His Holiness Hazrat Mirza Masroor Ahmad, may Allah strengthen his hands, dedicated the Friday sermon of 27th June 2014 to respected Mulana Abdul Wahab Adam as an exemplary Ahmadi Muslim. His Holiness related many examples of how Mulana Wahab had served the community and strived in his efforts. Various speeches were presented on the life and services of Mulana Wahab across many countries and how he was an example not only in his work but also his family life. Respected Missionary UK, Mulana Ataul Mujib Rashid gave a speech on the services of Mulana Wahab in the UK and Pakistan. Respected Missionary UK explained how Mulana Wahab always excelled in everything he did and was an example to those around him. The son of late Mulana Wahab, Mr. Hassan Wahab, gave a speech on the family life of his late father. He highlighted how at every step in his life, his father always sought guidance from the Honourable Khalifa. Respected Acting National President of the Ahmadiyya Muslim Community Ghana, Mulana Muhammad bin Saleh, gave a speech on the services of Mulana Wahab in Ghana. He highlighted how Mulana Wahab was respected and regarded by all leaders of all faiths and parties, so much so that the President of Ghana had a state funeral organised in his honour for his services to Ghana. Respected National President of the Ahmadiyya Muslim Community UK, Mr Rafiq Ahmad Hayad, gave a speech on the character of Mulana Wahab. Respected National President explained how Mulana Wahab was a man of peace with the highest level of piety and reverence to Allah. National President of the Pan-African Ahmadiyya Muslim Association, Mr Tommy Callon, explained that with guidance from His Holiness, a special merit award was established for missionaries of African origin that excelled in their efforts. This award will be known as the Abdul Wahab Adam Award. Winners of this year's award were announced at the reception and were presented with their award by His Holiness Hazrat Mirza Masroor Ahmad, may Allah strengthen his hands. For the first year of the award, it was presented to Mulana Muhammad bin Saleh, respected acting national president, Ghana, Mulana Azhar Hanif, respected vice national president, USA, Mulana Ibrahim bin Yaqub, respected national president, Trinidad and Tobago, Mulana Bakari Abadi Kaluta, in charge Swahili desk, Tanzania, and Mulana Abdul Ghaffar, regional missionary, UK. Following the award ceremony, His Holiness led the traditional silent prayer. A specially prepared meal was enjoyed by all attendees to commemorate this special occasion. This report is from MTA International UK Studios in London.